Police are probing a second overnight graffiti attack on a constituency office after anti-SNP slurs were sprayed in bright red paint on the outside of the building. Marion Fellows base in Motherwell was targeted on the same night MSP Aileen Campbell's hub in Carluke was also daubed with SNP out by vandals. A window at Ms Campbell's office was smashed during the attack, leaving the South Lanarkshire representative saddened. Ms Fellows, who is fighting to retain her seat in the Motherwell and Wishaw seat, defiantly vowed to fight on despite the attack. Officers do not believe the two incidents are linked, but say they are keeping an open mind over the investigation. Aileen Campbell's office in Carluk was targeted in a similar attack. In a statement posted on social media, Ms Fellows wrote, While those who oppose Scotland's right to choose our own future resort to slurs and criminality, my team and I will not be deterred from taking our message of change to the people of Motherwell, Wishaw, and Bells Hill. I'd urge anyone with information to contact the police so we can find those responsible. This appears to be a coordinated attack across two offices. Motherwell SNP hub vandalism, while those who oppose Scotland's right to choose our own future resort to slurs and criminality, my team and I will not be deterred from taking our message of change to the people of Motherwell, Wishaw, and Bells Hill. A Police Scotland spokesperson said, Officers in Motherwell received a report of vandalism at a constituency hub in Mary Street, around 10.10 a.m. on Wednesday 27 November, 2019. The incident is believed to have happened at some point between 6 p.m. on Tuesday 26 November, 2019 and 10 a.m. on Wednesday 27 November, 2019. We are also aware of vandalism to a constituency office in Carluk which happened around the same time. These are not currently being treated as linked but we are keeping an open mind. Anyone with information should contact police on 101 quoting incident number 0905 of Wednesday 27 November, 2019. For more on this story, visit the news article link.